Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Pax and Thoughts Monday. Uh, let's see what we got here. We've got uh, VIP bonus. Oh, come back, come back here. Uh, three times VIP bonus for a limited time on everything. Hmm, that's exciting. It is, appears that we are having a VIP week this week. Um, uh, that is exciting. We've also got uh, uh, unlock uh, week for commons. So for those that level too quickly and didn't get all your commons unlocked, here's a chance to get some of them, which is pretty exciting for folks that have been waiting for a long time. What is this way down here? Uh, tiny tears back. Don't need that. Uh, so we've got uh, a labyrinth of Dontia. And we got Ostrophrichosaurus uh, today for Earth Shattering. And then I think we've also got um, Battle for Survival, picking up some food, uh, Beasts of the Biodome. Uh, and then we've got um, other various things. We've got in our mail. Oh, a little thank you for being a VIP. What do we get? 350 loyalty points. Take that. It'd have been nice if that was three times, but I'll still take the 350. Thank you, Ludia. Uh, let's see. We've got some stuff to claim. Let's go pick some stuff up. Pack number one. Ugh, a mod right off the bat. Ooh, three times. 45 instead of 30. Very nice. Packs are back to not costing dino bucks. Uh, not that we bought any anyways, but there was some that weren't too bad. Uh, cash, cash, cash. Dino bucks here. What do we get here? It's probably a random assortment of things. Some potential DNA. You know what? I'm going to do one just because I'm curious how much loyalty points these are. So we'll check. Let's see what we get. DNA. Ah, food, food. Diplodocus for 950. 780, not really worth it from an exchange rate standpoint. So, oh, you only got one anyway, so, but hey, eh, why not? Why not take a chance? Why not? Um, let's see. Now, if we got the top prize in here, that would be pretty exciting. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Not today, not today. Oh, we got the top prize here, but uh, obviously not a pack, so it doesn't help us in our a double or triple loyalty point. Uh, another rare, not a big deal. Let's go ahead and max this out. Mm, I get a pack? Nope. No, no, no. I'm not gonna get the pack here. Okay. I'll do the other one later so I don't have to worry about the uh, video editing. Um, well, since we got a mod, so we'll get two more. We'll knock out uh, one of the PvP events before we go um, look into the Trade Harbor. Oh my goodness, I was up so late last night, so late, uh, getting the data for the boss. I didn't finish, I still technically haven't finished with the uh, setting up the new computer and transferring all the data from old computer to new computer. God, so interesting, the stuff that you, when you really are digging through a computer that you've had for a long time for information that um, you've collected over many a year. It's quite interesting, the, uh, the stuff that you start to house uh, in said computer. Uh, yeah, all sorts of random stuff, but uh, currently I left the computer transferring the music um, last night, and the wife is in the office, so I'm in the garage uh, this morning, but uh, 
look to see uh, what uh, what's left later on today. And then we can finally unhook the old computer from the second monitor, get the new computers hooked up to two monitors. Oh, that is not good. That is a bad, bad matchup. And he gets to go first. Just swap down to if he attacks, he does not yep, we're gonna have to swap down to this guy. We we'll have to kill off all of our creatures before we get a chance here. So he's gonna use two. Piercing bite. Which is what makes me the most nervous. Come on, use all six. Use all six. You know you want to. You know you want to. Okay, well, just, that's enough. He's got one left, so we're gonna have to use four. Mm, use five. Oh, I forgot he's got the intimidation on his side, that's why. Is he gonna swap? Nope, okay. Okay, this is where piercing bite comes in handy. a glitch in the um oh there it goes it went back there we go uh, but yes up all well, not all night up until way late um it's not till 12 30 in the morning which is late for me uh because i typically try to get up around five did not get up at five um because of that but uh, got all of the data on the boss. That's what happens when you leave so many levels um, to the last day. Um, all right, Velociraptor, here we go. And our quest for getting more and more of those guys. Um, all right, so Trade Harbor. Let's see, no. No. Okay, but we are going to refresh here. Let's get uh, I got three mil. There we go. Uh, so we'll do one refresh. Oh, I forgot I had those guys in my. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna take that right now. Gonna take that. Obviously going to take the AF to food trade. Everything else is for cash. Oh gosh, I almost forgot about that guy. That's what you get for not paying attention to what you just picked up. All right, we'll do that. Do a coins to Jurassic. All right, little Pachyceratops, take that guy. Uh, let's clean out our market real quick we got 25 percent hatchery going right now i'll probably clean off all of my uh creatures i'm not gonna clean off the aquatic because 
probably get a decent trade for that. Oh, yes, I guess I will. Didn't realize that one was full. Uh, yeah, let's pick this guy up. Drop him down, feed him up. Pick up uh, this guy. right now so we'll 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 chill right there um, but I wanted to do a refresh of the trade harbor and one custom trade to get the clock started on those um, I forgot who it was that it was on the set on the forms but I really appreciate the information or the insight of uh, that the clock starts when you do your first one so right now the clocks are running so the 24-hour refresh timer and then I'll do um, some refreshes throughout the day uh, and then also uh, custom trades throughout the day um, when those creatures are off their cooldown. Um, yeah, so let's get to some events. I don't want to do this. We'll go. We'll battle the survival first. It's a no brainer one. This is where your common hybrids uh, come in handy. Especially if you got uh, Pelicanopteryx, because he can take out every other common at level 40 without even really thinking about it. Uh, yeah, I'll be curious to see what else we get uh, this week for um, the VIP week. I don't, I have not looked on the forums yet to see if they have released any kind of schedule. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Um, it's nice when they do, because then you can kind of plan and know if um, a better discount is coming. Um, but uh, since we've got three times the pack points, or three times the loyalty points, might go do some some gold packs pick up a bunch of VIP creatures. Let's see what we get. Here we go. Speed that. One more battle. 50 DNA. All of it helps. One more. And I uh, thank you for those that uh, responded uh, to the video yesterday with uh, your park levels, if you had the same creatures. Um, looks like uh, uh, pretty low in the 50s get the same uh, creatures to fight on that Sunday battle and it's the same thing that Sunday battle is I think always park level based so depending on what it is this week it was Tiny Terrors um, I've seen the I forgot what the Carnivore one is called and I think there's also a herbivore one, maybe even a. Can you remember if there's a pterosaur one or not? Yes. Give me the three times. Oh, and like I said, for those that uh, the Clash of Titans did reset. Um, yep. So if you didn't do the Cygnosaurus one by yesterday, you missed out. Uh, okay, so let's let's do uh, the VIP. Uh, no, let's do the easy one first. Let's see the easy one. I have a lot of my stuff on cooldown from last night. Doing big damage missions or not big? Well, not missions. I got the damage missions done pretty quickly. I think I was done around like seven hundred and forty or eight hundred thousand damage on the boss to get through all the damage missions is where I was at. I ended up stopping at like 1.4 mil to get through all the levels of the boss to get to level 40, which is where the boss um, then does the same the same health and attack um, 
after that point, so there's no point in doing more than that on the boss. Uh, but it was a chore, a chore to get there. Uh, this should be one shot. And you're dead. I think this is also level based. Um, these two unlocks. So if you've got uh, high level carnivores, it's not going to count against you. Um, if you've got low level carnivores, it is going to count against you if that's all you have. Um, because I'm guessing it has nothing to do with your ferocity and everything to do with where your actual lineup sits. Uh, we'll go with Soprano Titan. Mm. Reserve, obviously, for our throwaway. Oh, there's a nice cold breeze. God, it was so warm last night still. God, it's been cooling off, but not until late in the morning. Um, it's been hot, hot up here. It was super drained yesterday. I went for a long run, or a longer run. I haven't gotten really to long run territory yet um, since I've been back running again, but man, I was drained yesterday. Longer run in the sun, and then had the kiddos outside in the sun for a little water play in the early morning before it got too hot and then crawling around the desk, moving, you know, unmounting stuff off the wall. Oh yeah, I was just, I'm a, I'm a slightly waste of space today uh, based on just how I feel. Uh, all right, let's see here. I don't know what we want to do. Come on, you can do it, you can do it, you can slide, there you go. I'll go with, uh, Two shot for all these guys. Plenty of health in case we gotta burn any off here. Da, 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 da. Not if you can hear that in the background, but that's the neighbor's AC kicking on. It's uh, seven in the morning. <laughs> it's, it's a good sign that it's not. Uh, it's not exactly. If they'd open their windows, they would know that it's uh, at least cool outside right now. Take advantage of the first two to three hours of the day, get some cooler air in the house, and then back it away. Just because I don't feel like guessing. Uh, but yeah, what do we got this week? Um, we'll have to look at the battles. Um, is it, I think, a common unlock? Oh, why am I doing three? Why am I doing three? Uh, is a common unlock every day except for tomorrow, I think? Um, so, Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday? There's four? I think, if I remember correctly, I'll have to check. I remember what the schedule said. Um, but, uh, yeah, we'll have to, we'll have to see here. So, tomorrow there's the Gen 2 Fury, so for 65 and plus, so again, if you, uh, I think I was talking yesterday on the video, um, there isn't a need to rush to go really past level 65. I was saying 60 yesterday for Clash of Titans, but... Level 65 is where they seem to have the cutoff point for the Gen 2 Fury events to unlock uh, the T-Rex Gen 2. I think the Velociraptor Gen 2 unlock happens lower, if I remember correctly. Could be wrong on that, but um, for T-Rex, it's a little later. Uh, so yeah, so Wednesday, Montasora, Thursday, and then Friday. Yeah, so... Every day except for Tuesday for a common unlock this week, which is nice. It's really going to help out for the uh, Clash of Titans 
the new one that started up just now. Uh, might not wait as long to do that in case there's any kind of glitch uh, like there was last time for that. Get it just knocked out right away. Come on, you can scroll. I'll go here. Curious what we're gonna have on the other. We probably won't do Beast of the Biodome on the video, um, but we'll do um, some battle stages uh, since those are only one battle. <laughs> But uh, I think we're going to go do a bunch of gold packs. I think that's a good idea. Ooh. Uh, that's not good. He's going to have five. He'll do four. I don't think he can kill us in four. He can't. Yep. He's not going for it. Probably could have just attacked. Oh, it's a good thing we didn't. You would have had enough to block and probably enough to kill us afterwards. So that's good. We did not go for it. Hmm. I wonder if the three times loyalty points he just says for a limited time. I wonder if it will be for more than just a day. Uh, yes, it was already unlocked. But thank you. All right, let's do only herbivores this time, okay? We used a lot of the herbies last night, uh, at least the Segnos, because of the high attack Stick it depths. Can't do anything, T Rex. Sorry. Let's go with this guy. <sighs> what? Yeah, hopefully everybody um, got the DNA that they were looking for out of the boss. I only got 62 missions done, but again, I was just trying to collect data. Um, I didn't have the time to just knock out all the missions. Um, I got stuck on a few that uh, just the do four attack one. <clears throat> Cause 
again, I was just trying to do massive amounts of damage to get through boss levels yesterday, uh, so I didn't get a chance to knock out all the missions, but I um, did like 40-something missions yesterday while I was doing that, so I'm happy enough with that. Uh, but again, most of the DNA comes from the damage missions, uh, and the rest of it's kind of, not piddly, but um, all good good things, but uh, kind of didn't need to push as hard. Did I use all of them? I think so, but we'll do one more just in case. Again, this guy's already unlocked, but doing it for the pack. And as the loyalty points, let's take a certain time to bring him in. But yeah, any any packs as a VIP player that you can open up. Maybe even, uh, you know, grinding some PvP and get that triple loyalty point bonus. It's, uh, it's nice when they do this for the VIPs. I know we really appreciate it. Sometimes they do four times, and that might be sometime this week that they do four times. Um, but I'm not going to take the chance. Um, three times is good. Four times is obviously better, but uh, sometimes it's also four times on, you know, what you purchase. Okay, so he did one. Ooh, I did not use his other one. Okay, so he's only have three. So we're okay. Swap in the throwaway. Here first. Battle stage. 93. Alright, so we can do a flyer. No problem. Go with the Matrofa down. We only have two strong creatures here and then one weak creature, so. Probably could have even done an amphibian and not had any problems with that Tupaxara. Don't need the black. You got Baranox? Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought you got. Okay. 
Working on a relayout of the park on the new island, trying to make it uh, more visitor friendly esque, if that makes sense. I know there's no visitors in the park, but I uh, like to think that. Oh, Mosasaurus, there we go. I'll take that guy. Let's take those as well. Uh, not gonna worry about the DNA one for now. Let's go. Let's go open a bunch of packs. Uh, Plasaurus, Prestosuchus. Nope, we're going gambling. Let's see if um, they lowered the pack price on these. Nope, they didn't. Sweet. Last time they had a VIP bonus offer, they lowered the what these were worth, which was kind of a janky move. Here we go, there's a Jurassic, so one Jurassic, one Aquatic. Those are first books, oh, another Jurassic. Let's go down to a hundred thou. This is why I save up. Oh, a Potosaurus, yes. It's three Jurassic, one Aquatic. Four Jurassic, one Aquatic. Hmm. I actually don't mind if I get uh, a little mixture. I mean, I'll take the Jurassic Zone some bucks, yeah. Oh, as soon as I say that, two aquatics now. That is another Jurassic. Because all these creatures in these packs, all of them in the 10k pack, are good. They will benefit your game. It's some, oh yes, Prototherium. Need some Savannas. But, I mean, any of these creatures in these packs are good for your overall game. So, I know some folks early on are really only focused on Jurassics, so they get bummed out when they get uh, some of the other ones, but long term, every single Jurassic in these packs are good for your game. And they're teaming winger as well. We're not getting a big variety, that's for sure. You can cabinet it as one. And Olympia. Take it. Do one more, so we'll dip just below 100,000. Not a huge variety. Lots of uh, Jurassics, though. Yep, just below. And let's see. Let's. I got a lot of speeding up to do. So let's just speed them all up. Let's get them. Let's get them in there. Let's see, we'll speed this guy up. We don't want him chilling in our market. Yes. Um, put in this guy. Let's get the Mosasaurus in there. Um, also put the T-Rex in. And everything else. We'll speed up except the Ostafricosaurus. Seventy-five bones apiece. 
Not too bad. Lots of amorphodons. Sweet, so I get that pack. I've been trying not to, um, trying not to level my VIPs anymore. I'm just trying to max out the paddocks. This is gonna help a lot on the um, on the Jurassic side. And we're gonna have a whole bunch of feeding to go do when we're all done with this. Five percent discount on hatching. This isn't too bad, especially for the the bucks that we got in some of those packs. You know, for every hundred uh, Dino bucks we got, is basically a free hatching of uh, of these guys. So. Oh, I'm just gonna wait for that guy. I'm picking up coins we don't necessarily need. Let's do coins for Jurassic. Connor Raptor, I'll take that. Uh, hatch this guy. We'll put the corn raptor in last. Last VIP creature. All right, and then we'll go and uh, go. later to bore you guys with watching me feed everybody um, let's pick up a few more coins oh, that's not what I want to do I misclicked Ooh. game's trying to catch up with all the data that I just threw at it with all those hatchings Fresh here. That's the wrong way. I need coins to food. I'll take coins to Dino Bucks though. Nope, not right now. I'm not gonna. Oh, I forgot about that. Uh, I'm guessing this isn't gonna get tripled, but it would be nice if it did. No. And we're back up above. A hundred thousand. Just like that not doing that if that was triple I would do it but not right now okay let's see we'll do another one I want to make sure I don't have anything else in my market that I shouldn't have yep taking that doing that. Nope. If it was the other way around, that would be fantastic. All right. Uh, and that, my friends, is going to do it. I know we did not get uh, this all done, but for sake of the video, um, I'm not going to do... Um, those last two missions. Uh, we got this all done over here. And we'll do those later. But uh, for now, we will call that good. Everybody have a wonderful Monday. And uh, we'll catch you guys on the next video. 
If you made it this far, I appreciate you watching all the way to the end. Subscribing to my channel and clicking the notification bell will ensure that you'll be notified as I release videos on the channel. If you found this video helpful, let me know by hitting the like button. If there is something specific you would like a video on in the game, please leave a message in the comment section below on what you would like to see. Again, thank you for tuning in, and I will catch you on the next one.